I want to get this guy wet. <laughs> I want to get this troll wet. Okay. Let me let me try again. I need to wet. <laughs> Hello everyone, my name is Gracian, and this is episode 4 of this Let's Play of Age of Wonders 4, as we're playing as Verda Firethorn, the uh, mist, misty animal summoning, lightning worshipping goat lady. And we are sieging this random neutral city here so that we can just vassalize it. I don't, I don't, actually, what, what are they, dark it looks like? Dark. S Sorceress lizard men. Leaf skin already, animal kinship. Dark gifted. Um, they kind of fit in with my faction, t not too terribly badly. I might actually integrate this city now that I think about it, especially if it's going to be a little while before I can get another one because of the space issues we're having over here. Maybe I can sneak a city in over here somewhere. Anyway. So it looks like the siege is ready. Um, do I want to summon a yet another animo? I guess I might as well. Got another piggy. So we'll just go ahead and attack. Uh, and that's a. Pr uh, let's do it manually because it'll be fun. It'll be fun to figure out how to get into the walls when I don't have any siege equipment. Or demolish your animals. Now, do they have any battlements? I don't think they did, right? These are just basic vantage point. Obscured, ignore obscured. Yeah, see, I feel like this doesn't work though sometimes. Four. Five. Okay, so it does work. But only for, for physical damage. Alright, whatever. Um, wild speaker. So let's summon an animal. Back you up a little bit. Especially when there's a uh, frost, frost guy right there. We don't want to get hit by that. It's a real animal, but we can just kind of sneak in the side. And where's my crow? There's nothing over here. So we're gonna we're gonna make a break for it. But you're a shield unit, so I'm gonna send you over. You're into here. Put you in defense. Do they have AoE? I don't Whirlwind Strike. It's a single target. We're good there. We'll just wait a turn. Ouch. Alright, they use their curse curse strike or whatever it's called. Sundering curse or whatever. So I'll just back those piglets out, I think. Yeah, I'll just back out. Alright, where are all my summoned units? We've got a piggy right here. We've got a wormy right here. We're just gonna go. I'm just gonna go in. You guys go ahead and back on out. No reason to lose you. Now these guys will do extra damage to these guys. So I really don't want them getting hit by the warlocks. If I can help it. Just the web. Nope, just the one. Go wait. Crows. Now these are are these flying? Any train can safely move past most of their obstacles. Okay, so they should be able to fly over this. I just have to wait a turn, I think. Oh, total miss. Yuck. They are very low. That's awesome. Okay, I'm 
good. Not gonna do much. Six still seems like a lot, to be honest, for that single model that's left in there. Trying to weaken us. That's an ice spider. Why are you shooting it with ice? Not very smart. A little more light in here. So we've got cancel defense mode. Oh, that's a pole arm, but again, this is a summon unit, so it doesn't really matter. You can, you can eat up the uh, yeah poisonous. Okay. all waiting on our chance to get in. Electrify, that's good. And fly in, kill these guys off. Look at this big clog up here. This is why we need ways to break down the walls. Oh, it was a Lancer. A lot of brawling going on right here. I gotta get these pikemen out of the doorway so I can get in. Alright, we've got the summoned unit. It's not that much damage though. Mm. I'm gonna buff somebody up. The spiders are quite low. I might want to back them out. Just trying to get in there and get to these dumb archers here. Okay, Graze, Electrified though, which means it's gonna take eight damage, uh, which will kill him. He's dead at the end of his turn. Let me in, <laughs> let me in, I can't get through. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, there we go. That'll upset him. Yeah, we got birds. Let's see if we can go blind to this guy. 14% chance. Okay. Ninety percent. Yeah, I'd rather have the two shots, I think. It's a hero, so he's not really losing any any power here. Okay, but now we can back up here, get a couple shots in. Okay, that looks good. Just random spider. You're still hanging in there, but you'll be dead at the end of your turn. This guy can't really get any value here, so I'm comfortable ending turn without doing anything else. Summon units are gone. You just instant death meet or something? That's annoying as fuck. What the hell happened? Yeah, I don't I don't know what happened there. Um Assassinate. This is a three action ability. Which means I can't do it because I'm in zone of control. And I can't move a hex and then use it because I won't have three action points. So this guy has to stay dead. Oh man, that's annoying. That is really frustrating. I wish there was an enemy left so I could... Alright, is there any way... 
you had sprint, we could do it. If I had a way to push this guy back. I don't think there's a way to do it. I need this guy to move. Does he have slip away or anything like that? God damn it. Wait, I have an idea. Too many allies died. What if I defend until he runs away? Then I can resurrect that unit. I'm a genius. This guy needs help though. Um, restore, here we go. All right, hang in there, bud. over there. That's annoying. Um, okay, still not losing much morale, unfortunately. Uh, let's do this shot. The retaliation. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Disengaging shot. This makes you jump back. Why would you die? Your first strike? I don't know. I don't know what's going on there. Uh, I still can't. Oh, I can. I'm not in zone control. Yes. You were a fool. You were a fool to move spots. Why is this not going to... Why would that have killed... I don't understand. Let me know in the comments why that would have killed her. Them. I don't understand that. They're supposed to jump back. All right, we did it. We resurrected that unit. Feel vindicated. Hey, <laughs> one health. Nice. And he's got a gold medal. All right, awesome. So we'll go ahead and absorb this. I think we'll absorb these poison boys and make them our own. Um, in the meantime, I think I'll split these armies up. Send this one down to start getting some stuff done. Like over here and such. Don't heal at all in that because it's not our territory. Oops. And then you've got a bunch of stuff. A bunch of evolution stuff. That guy's getting up there. Um. It's just an outpost. Primal Darter. Yeah, I feel like I'm going to have to be making Primal Darters. Oh, Animus. I don't yet have any healing. So I have so many support units out. None of them heal. They just make animals. Um, let's not get too crazy here. All right, what else do we need? In order to get stuff like the Granary, we need another Forester. That's pretty easy. We can also get another farm and try to make it grow, like, really grow quickly here. Grab this farm. It'll extend our vision quite a bit. In fact, there's even somebody here, probably a neutral. I should send somebody out that way. Another spirit tracker. Hero leveled up, Seraphine gold, signature skill. Virulent outbreak is something you could do, I guess. Oh, and then your support abilities grant fortune so we want to give you active support abilities heals units and would gain fortune um this is just health and yes yeah, so let's get spiritual healing we want active support units support abilities collected somebody in the crypt um mm. 
Yeah, maybe once we get a, a hero that would use that. I'm gonna queue this up, but probably not cast it yet. Because I don't need to pay the upkeep. I don't want to pay the upkeep. Okay, so this has just got a little bit left. We've got a scout over here. Do want to get that seal eventually, but I don't think there's a whole there's a big rush on that at the moment. Over the mountains. And it's another province. So we have a, a forester and a... So let's get a quarry. Now this is going to be my city. So I don't have to worry about gobbling up each other's space so much. So I might just grab a quarry like right... Oh, this, this is uh, expanding rather quickly. Let's just grab this one. Or maybe this one so we can... Wow, this is going to be... Yeah, I got plenty of space. I want to be able to get into the water here. You're building. Okay. All right, King Slyer, King Kins Kinslyer, Kinslyer. What? Let's rename that. Um. So these are these are poisonous lizards, but they 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 share a kinship with me in terms of animals and nature. So let's call these. Um, gosh, let me pause and think of something. Okay, I'm gonna call this city Chameleon. So it's Chameleon and a million put together, uh, because they started with they have so much population. Uh, it was kind of surprising. So there's like a million chameleons here. Chameleons. And me and chameleons. Anyway. Okay, so now we can annex something. So what do what have we built in this city? Structures. Walls, workshops, storehouse, stone, mason, shrine. Perfect. Great stuff. Great, great stuff. Mm, so we could afford to get the storm, storm crow temple for them. That would start altering this to grassland, which we like better. So let's get that right away. And then it looks like we need a forester for some of the boosts, uh, which we can't get yet because this terrain is kind of bad for that. Um, might grab this farm then, just for growth. Fish farm. Draft. Okay, so you you guys just, um, we're gonna go clear out some of this stuff over here. We'll just wait a second, because this is you're quite low. I think next turn we'll go. We'll be okay with just one wounded unit. And then you are headed off to this quest. And then you've got an extra darter to take with you. Um, should I put that there? Put the pig in there for the passive experience. Yeah, and then I might actually also move, say... Never mind, we're out of movement. Okay. Oh, 34 knowledge. Oh, that was a little mountain range I had to cross over. Whoops, that's okay. We're going to go down below and check check out what's there in a second. Should I go down below? I should probably just peek. Oh, it's frozen over. Snow. Frozen waste. Interesting. Ooh, we finished Lightning Blade. That's gonna be nice. Oh, there's a, uh, a visitor coming here. This is the tripod. This is Kepri. See, she doesn't have an arm here. Uh, it's a little hard to see, but... Nah. Well, it's really hard to see, because she doesn't have it. <laughs> um, lightning Blades are done. So let's go in there, and that's... Ah, 10 mana short. Or 10 casting points. Rainbow Clover acquired. Where? Here? Yes, right in the city's province. Interesting. Another ruler was denounced. Yeah, so everybody hates everybody. Let's actually check on that. So, so your relationship with... 
Uh, Locutus and Sea Sand are at negative 700. Uh, Locutus has not met Paul Buck. Um, Paul Buck and I are minus 100. So I, I could make a declaration of friendship. Start working on that. Minus 100 between Paul and Sea Sand and their neighbors, and then those two haven't met. And then Sea Sand is the one that really hates Locutus. And then I also don't get along well with Locutus. So the three of us don't like each other, uh, pretty much. But then Buck is okay with everybody. These may not be friends for very long since they're so close now. You became the race keeper of the sorceress lizard men. Okay. And turn. Gotta slay these units pretty soon here. I can probably do that now. Yeah, whoops, faux pas. During a diplomatic negotiations, Elder Tarion Fox of Elder Camp approaches you, quaking with anger. <laughs> I receive reports of your heroine, Sarah Feingold, bad-mouthing me. Um, when it comes to minor elders, Sarah Feingold can say whatever she pleases. That's correct. You don't get to tell Sarah Feingold what she can and cannot say about you. Sarah Feingold is one of my trusted lieutenants. Uh, what did we just build? Another, another scout. Let's get in the water. And then we want to go fight this group here. This is somehow closer than I thought. But I'm going to auto it and just... Yeah, I don't know why that was... Anyway. Train new recruits. Nope. Go get a new one. We could get a nightmare. But you can't use that with a staff, right? Or loyalty. Avenge your old mount. Go train a new one. But I don't think she can use it. But we'll have it in our store. We can, we can give it to somebody else. Actually, can you use the mount? Oh, yeah, you can. Sarah, do you mind if I borrow your nightmare mount? Thanks. Okay. So we got a seal here. So we have easy control over two of the seals. Really easy control. And then where are the other ones? There's one down here. Um, okay, that's it. And then this is going to be two polar bears, which have a one hex cone swipe. Immune to frozen. They don't take frost damage. We don't do that. Cast this. It cost me 17 mana. So I do have a lot of fighter units. <gasps> wait, wait, wait. Did this guy evolve? Hell. Ugh, sorry. Hell yeah, Tide Spirit. How do you get these guys again? I never figured that out. So this guy does lightning damage. So he wets them and then continuously shocks them. Pretty cool. There's just the three of them. All right, retry that one. No reason to lose that unit. So they've just got a bunch of beaters. They're just gonna come in and just beat on me. Um, You've got this thing, which is really cool. That's really strong, I feel like. Let's get you up here. Let me look at that. Yeah, okay. So we're gonna get you right here. You're gonna go in only if absolutely necessary. Virulent outbreak. Could also, spiritual healing this one, like right off the bat, just so it is useful. Because it's missing a lot of health here. So we've summoned crows, unfortunately. Not what I would not not something I would say is particularly useful in this this fight. I'm gonna wet these polar bears so hard. All right, ready? Get wetted. 
I got smacked. Damn it. Let's go ahead and restore. Use fortune and regeneration. Alright. That's lightning damage. Now it's wet, so it does it takes extra damage. Let's boost up these guys. Oh my god, is this a flanking shot from here? No. Did I roll a crit on that? Oh my god. How did I roll a crit? What did the skill give out? Killing momentum and two strengthened. Roll to hit critical, passes check. Sustains damage. Why did I get a crit? Why did I crit? Does anyone know? Am I standing on something that gives crit chance? Nope. I literally do not know why I got a crit, so if somebody could um, if somebody could explain that to me based on what we saw. Ah, flanker plus 10% critical chance. So this one this one had a 10% chance to crit because of a passive from Sarah. Nice job, Sarah. So we just got the we just got a little lucky with that crit there. It's awesome. Okay. And then you don't have any retaliations left. Fury of the Stormcrow is active on my uh, random spiders I summoned. Poisoned. Which kind of fucking up these polar bears, I have to say. Don't stand much of a chance here. No, not my summoned birds. <laughs> no! That's quite silly. Turn on my light a little higher. Um, so this is uh, going to be easy to finish. I just got to figure out the best way to do it. Some magical blast. This could electrify. Grazed. Dang. You to get the. Yeah. We doing okay here, guys? Kind of, kind of being annoying here. Let's kill him off here. I want to get this guy wet. <laughs> I want to get this troll wet. Okay. Let me let me try again. I need to win. <laughs> there we go. I need to cover him in water so I can electrocute him. There we go. Poisoned. Crits. Nice. Hell yeah. Oh yeah. So do the summoned units have the pack leader? No, they don't. So I bet that means that Verda Firethorn Summon Crow doesn't have any of her animal buffs. Good to good to know. Good to think about. Uh, and then because we have basically no range over here. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, I guess he lives to tell another tale here. He's got two health. Hit him! He's got two health again. Did he have temporary HP, I guess? He died. What a ridiculous fight. Hey, these metals are getting up there. This is exciting. I can't wait for them to evolve. And then I can't pay their upkeep. Mm, I love it. So you are done with your quest. Now we're waiting on our... Um, we might go to war with uh, Locutus soon. Mm, so I might want to consolidate my forces a little bit and go um, go test the waters down there. Now, the reason I have so much military power is because I've been summoning animals like a motherfucker. Um, I have another hero in four turns. So maybe it's time to start 
summoning more animals. Get you over. So we want to go like maybe take that out and get the rank up. Yeah, that's actually a really good idea because it's oops, stay in your borders because uh, we can we can get all the um, evolution units into the stack. Uh, I'm in danger. Something down here. Yeah, there's nothing down here at all. Lavish Arcadia. Are they Mystic? Is that what that is? Rodent Lightbringers. No, so they are uh, high. Arcane Research. Makes base magic attacks of enchanted units deal plus two lightning damage and a chance of inflicting electrify and that goes on battle mages and supports if I'm gonna have a bunch of wild speakers that have nothing to do after they've cast a unit and put a buff on it then maybe having they would get plus four lightning damage um, and then have a chance to inflict that that's something we could do Target race more bestial when adjacent to a friendly animal. Both units are granted damage and crit chance. Uh, and then evokers, of course. I kind of want all of these things. Let's get animal kinship. The stone whatever. Uh, I'm actually over time. I gotta end this episode. Whoops. Fuck, I didn't want to build that. I right clicked it. <laughs> Shit. Um, yeah, I'll just leave that in there. Uh, so let's end this episode here because we are all out of time. So thank you everybody so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this series so far. If you have, please like and subscribe if you haven't already. Check the link in the description for my Patreon if you want to support the channel and also have double entries into showing up as characters in my games that I play. And I will see everybody in the next episode. Thanks for watching.